All right, we are playing some Milio support, which I don't think I have made a video yet talking about how broken this lane is. So I'll go into that in just a second. But we are running Airy Mana Flow, Transcendence, Gathering Storm, Revitalize, uh, Bone Plating, one CDR, one Adaptive Force, one Armor. Playing up against the new Rel Rework, which did give us some trouble last game. You know, come to think of it, I think this is the exact same bot lane that we played up against last game. And they did get the better, uh, the best of us in the last game, but we have Lucian this time around, which, uh, again, Lucian Milio, if you guys aren't familiar, is probably the strongest bot lane in the game right now. And I don't say that as an exaggeration or for clickbait or anything like that. It's essentially Lucian Nami, but even better. Pretty nutty. Um, again, Lucian's passive allows him to do extra damage every single time you buff him up, which is why Nami was so good with him. But Milio is just a better version of Nami, so I can use all my abilities on him, and he just does a shit ton of damage. So hopefully we can get a chance to showcase it here. I already showed you guys level 1 just by using E on him. He dashes forward, and we win that trade pretty hard. He also did a good job of uh, saving his E for Rel to go in, so... If I can position well and not allow Rel to get on top of me, and he can as well, I don't see any way we ever lose these uh, two, two fights. Uh, Cleemore, how's it going, my man? Welcome into the stream. I just need to wait for him to show any sign that he wants to play aggressive, and then we're good to go. But maybe he, he doesn't want to like dash in as you would typically do as Lucian because he wants to see. This seems fine. He's gonna have to flash away, right? Okay, not bad. He actually stayed in that fight a lot longer than I thought he would. Took a lot of extra damage. And hopefully that gives Lucian the confidence. Like, he can get hit by CC and we still won fights. Also, no J4 is top side right now, hovering around mid. So we're good to continue to play aggressive here, unless... Okay, we're just getting a ward. Oh, what are you flashing? I think we can win this. Oh, what did you say? Were you backing up? You're backing up! Too far? Oh, I feel so bad. Okay, that went fine. You, like, never see opportunities to actually play aggressive as Milio, and there was one there for me to flash forward land the Q get the CC and allow us to continue moving forward but right as I went in he backed up that's unfortunate all right not a big deal just no flash good fight though Uh, why do so many enchanters take heal over ignite or exhaust by the way ignite kind of doesn't synergize well with your kit because ideally you're playing a little bit further back you're not getting close enough to ignite exhaust does make sense because people are coming to you um, instead of you going to them and if they're a threat you want to be able to exhaust them uh, but heal just makes sense right you're an enchanter you're already focusing a lot on on healing and shielding so you just have that heal as well um, and it allows the adc to take something a little bit better for them so if they're in immediate danger they have exhaust or they have cleanse or um some adcs that don't have a, a lot of mobility will take ghosts like jinx or something like that it just synergizes more with uh, the play styles okay they get dragon which means j4 is nearby and i don't have any wards so I'd love to play aggressive, I miss Mama's but I don't know if someone's here. And although I'm confident we can win 2v2, even if Lucian gets hit by everything from Rel, I don't know if we win 3v2. I traveled to another village 
kind of like this. We got a CS lead. But that's not enough. We, we have a really winning lane. I'd like to be further ahead than we currently are. I guess we did grab a plate. No wards right now makes this uh, pretty difficult. I want to play aggressive, just don't know where J4 is. Oh, we have eyes. So we go. An enemy has been slain. He didn't have E yet. Because he used it on the freaking minion. Oops, I pinged the wrong thing. Pretty solid. I think my Q broke up something from Rel there. I feel... I want to say they ignited there, too. So they used sums and we didn't. You get a ward here, and I'll try to push this out as far as possible. Yeah, they're really low and still playing confident. Someone definitely could be on the way. J4 is top, though. No, I, I... Okay, I think we just have to commit to this. If Renekton comes, so be it. Let's look for some plates here, though. I don't know if we necessarily kill them, though, when they get back. Because they're spending their gold right now. Let's just get this wave and get out of here. Also, I need to ping this, because this guy likes to roam a lot. We learned that last game. I can roam to Rift here. Uh, Rel did roam, as we kind of figured she would. If I'm planning to roam, might as well pick up some kind of boots here. Also, don't need to roam, though, or go to Rift if we can find an angle to just go bot and continue to, to win bot. Don't want to take myself out of a, a winning lane matchup, you know what I mean? I'm good to keep going here. Uh-oh. How is this not just winning for us, though? Huge. Yeah, like, in what world do we not just win that? Now, I will say this about the Rel, the Rel rework. Um, you do still have the same problem of being slow when you go in. So if you go in and you have a bad engage, good luck. There's, there's no getting out of there. I was just overly confident, I'm not sure. Not too sure what they had in mind there. Um, there's quite a bit of people collapsing here. Oh, but we're getting collapsed on, man? Um, that to me looked like Lucian feeling himself a little too much and being a little too focused on the J4 that was there and not on the Rel and the Renekton that were coming through the river. That was a situation I wanted to run away from and he ran straight into it. Not great. We throw a little bit of our lead there. Okay, lucky for us, I 
steal these. <laughs> Never mind. Okay, let's try to uh, get tower here. You should know that we're here, to be honest. Also, Renekton is behind us now. And poor Yasuo might get himself killed trying to follow the roam. We could rotate, but we could also just take tower. Rotating does not guarantee us anything. Tower does. I'm fine with this. He could just go over the wall, though. Oh, he didn't go over the wall. Does this look like a Rel who has flash? I don't think so. Okay, my Q man really took that. Oh, good. I'm really not too worried about the J4 coming down. It's mainly been the Renekton. I'm going to go ahead and recall early. Let Lucian gather all of this. Okay, this game's going much better than the last. Much, much better. Melio is so fun. Yeah, I, I agree. He's really simple, but I enjoy him. I, I like his playstyle. I don't feel useless. I bet Papa's in the garden right about and his cooldowns are short enough to the point that like you're you're constantly active in fights. Someone like Nami, it feels like you use all your abilities and then you're like sitting there for six, seven seconds. Not doing a whole lot. Also, I think the Q is a big thing. Again, I think Nami's probably the best comparison. But, like, it's pretty hard to land a, a Nami Q. Whereas Milio Q, Q feel, feels easier to use. That was uh, a little spooky. All right, there's four people mid right now. Let's be careful for just a second here. Um, he's going in. J4 and Renekton are probably here still. Yeah, knocking back and engage does feel really, really good. Honestly, they used a lot for me. And they just got my ulti. We get a tower for that. I don't know. Trading Rel Flash? Wait, maybe I should hold. I'm saying because it's Micah Forley. That's oh, not bad. Pretty she good. Yeah, trading Rel Flash? For Milio ulti and a tower does not seem all that worth. That just seemed like they were getting really impatient and tried to force something and just were like, well, I guess we'll go after the Milio. Did you say something for me, Yeah, I don't know. I don't mean to be that guy. <laughs> Nice. Milio God, what can I say? You know you're doing something right when you're getting recognition on a champion like Milio. Oh. 
Attenzione. Doing a little bit too much, maybe. Yeah, yeah, dragon sounds good to me. I, th I think we should just take the dragon. Let's, uh, let's not get too crazy here. We're winning, but we're not, like, that far ahead. That's not the best ulti I've ever seen. Oh my. Oh my, where did they go? Okay, I'm gonna be honest. I, I knew we were ahead in this game. I didn't know we were that ahead in this game to the point that we could just do that whenever we wanted to. Alright, let's get Tyron out. My team should be able to get that by themselves. League seems kind of buggy these days, by the way. You had a sudden FPS drop in the stream. I That might just be my computer. Kind of need to upgrade my computer, but don't have the funds to do so right now. I also really want to upgrade my mic because I've been playing some games with the uh, For Fun Squad recently, which, by the way, we're doing that later today, approximately like three hours from now. We'll be playing some games with them. And I didn't realize how bad my mic quality was until I was playing with them. Because in the YouTube videos, obviously, it's me and four other guys, and you can hear all of our voices, and mine is clearly not as high quality as theirs. This is the farthest they've ever and so I, I just didn't realize how bad it was until I had that direct comparison. And so I reached out to um, somebody who... Um, works for like blue the blue microphone company and honestly back back in the day when i was a bit of a, a bigger name person back when like i was relevant uh he used to offer me free stuff like my current setup and everything right now is all stuff he gave me uh oh hold on Um, if Lucian can rejoin this fight, I think we'll be in a good spot. Keep going, buddy. Alright, nice. Uh, to finish what I was saying, I, I reached out to somebody that I know works at Blue Microphone, and I guess I'll finish that story in a second, because that's GG's. Solid game. 